everybody. Mr. Deary here, Thursday, the 26th of March. We're still in spring break, and I want to talk to you today about incentives and rewards um, because I'm actually doing this for myself right now. Behind me over that way, my office is a mess. I've taken some time to get some of the things that I needed to get taken care of uh, for, in some cases, months, if not years, organized. I've taken a bookshelf apart. I've pulled out old personal files, taxes, bills, etc. And I'm in the process of trying to put it all back in a way where it's not just shoved in there and looks like a mess. Every time I open my office door, it drives me crazy. And in the process, I've covered my guest bed in baskets of things, thank you cards, bills, uh, educational textbooks. Um, I found an airsoft gun back there uh, from when I was like 18. So like this is obviously a dumping ground of, of all sorts of things. So I've made myself a promise that I'm going to give myself a reward. You know, so I'm going to have something to work for as soon as I get this taken care of. Now, I'm a big old geek, so for me, that's going to be Animal Crossing, uh, the New Horizons game for the Switch. I am stoked to play that. I just bought it. It's on its way, and I know when it gets here on Sunday, I want to be able to play it right away. So what I want to do then is incentivize myself, give myself a reason, a purpose, uh, more of a thought, uh, not a thought, more of a... Uh, a thoughtful approach into when I can get this done, a timeline, if you will. I'm really itchy today. I'm sorry about that. Don't touch your face, CDC. Anyway, so for me, it's going to be spending time every day chipping away at this and getting that project done. And that way, when it is done, I can play that game. I'm setting this rule up for myself. I'm setting up this this condition for me to be able to play that game. So if it comes on Sunday and I'm not done, well, then I have to finish. I can't just do that. So maybe you are falling into a slump where you are struggling to do anything, where you're just feeling unmotivated, where you kind of just want to melt into your phone, into YouTube, into Hulu or Netflix or something, and just kind of just binge your way through it. Now, during spring break, that's not necessarily going to be a problem. But if that happens once we come back next Monday, that is problematic. So maybe it's setting aside some time every day where you are going to do some reading, do some writing, do some of your work that you know you didn't do before spring break because everything was crazy and nobody was really kind of doing anything. That's how you perceived it. But regardless of that, that is what we need to do in our lives. Give ourselves some purpose, give ourselves some incentive and reward ourselves for the things that we have to do. Whether that be like for, again, I'm on, I'm trying to lose some weight right now. Every week I get a cheat day. So I have to be good in order to get that cheat meal. I have to be under my calories. I have to be able to do what I need to do in order to have that. Maybe it's for you, you have to get up and move around. Maybe it's you have to take a shower. Um, even those little things that might just kind of build up and then all of a sudden it's been four days and you're in the same pair of sweatpants and you don't see the point. That's the kind of stuff that we need to set up some basic incentives of. Okay. I will be able to take a nap today if I do two things this morning, if I do a load of laundry and something else. Um, I'm going to have, you know, some food delivered, uh, so long as I go out and work out this morning. So find something that you want to do, find something you need to do and create a system that you can hold yourself to, accountable to, to incentivize those kind of rewards. We got one more day this week. Tomorrow, I got something kind of fun out in the garage. I'm going to get started here. And we'll maybe we'll do a time last of that over the weekend. Maybe it's early next week. But just know that you are missed, um, that this is an uncertain time, and it's okay to feel that way. And again, at any time, if you need anything, don't hesitate to reach out and ask for help. As always, Mr. Deary wishing you a great rest of your day.